High definition. This is Fox 2 News Edge. With the ninth anniversary of 9-11 just days away, Missourians are finding ways to give back. Next on the edge, one local agency that's benefiting from that service attitude. On Friday, Missouri will join other states to recognize the 9-11 Day of Service. It's to recognize how Americans volunteered to keep the country strong following the terror attacks. Fox 2's John Abel found many volunteers donating their time at the St. Louis Area Food Bank in Bridgeton. Why do you volunteer? That's the right thing to do. Like everybody else, this schnook supermarket manager from O'Fallon, Missouri, wanted to contribute after 9-11. He chose the largest food bank in the state of Missouri. We all feel very fortunate. All of us here, we're all working. We have jobs. So, yes, we feel very fortunate. So this is a way to give back. Urged by various political leaders, volunteerism has been on the rise. At the food bank alone, volunteer director Britt Moeller says those donating time has risen by some 2,000 people over the past year. We're going to hit probably 12,000 volunteers coming in this year, donating 36,000 hours of their time, um, which is equivalent to about 17 full-time employees all year round. If we were to pick ourselves up by our bootstraps, we were told we had to work together. It makes sense. Are you amazed at how many people do volunteer? Uh... Oh, I am. It, it never ceases to amaze me. I see lots of people here um, helping at the food bank. Rose Rue Brown is part of the volunteers from the Merits Organization. Corporations, by the way, are third on the list of volunteers behind groups from churches and schools. The food bank can use all the help they can get, and it doesn't take much to learn what they do. Pretty impressive, and it's going pretty smooth. They gave us a uh, about a half hour of directions and turned us loose. John Abel, Fox 2 News. The Missouri Community Service Commission will honor emergency responders during a ceremony at 8.30 Friday morning on the Capitol steps in Jefferson City.